travelingmail.com. Hey, hey, you guys. Thanks for joining us on our big adventure for the day. We are taking the train from Vongen, from Vongen, from Vangen, sorry, uh, down to the Lauterbrunnen Valley where we're gonna go for a little walk up to a waterfall, Trommelbach Waterfalls, which is inside the mountain. And it looks crazy and it looks cool, so we're excited about that. And we'll see what else happens today. Lauterbrunn is kind of the gateway to the Jungfrau and it's a pretty small town but it's got these great classic Swiss style buildings, um, restaurants, hotels, all that sort of thing. A lot of traffic because people come through here to get up into the mountains, further up the valley, etc. Um, and also there are a couple really cool waterfalls. There's 72 waterfalls in the valley um, but two big ones are here. Obviously the Trommelbach where we're headed, but there's this other famous one that you see a lot of in pictures and that sort of thing, whose name I don't remember. There it is. It's right there. Stabach Fall. This is Stabach Falls and it's kind of famous in waterfall circles, kind of special. And it is really pretty spectacular, all that water coming over the rock like that. Quite lovely. about a 30 minute walk from Lauterbrunnen to Trommelbach Falls. And it's a beautiful day, lots of scenery. We just crossed the creek. Everybody's out here walking and strollering and riding their bikes and face jumping off the cliffs. It's, it's quite, a, quite an active, beautiful day. picnic by the creek and then walked in here and paid for us for a family with a visitor's card it was 28 francs um, and that's about 28 29 dollars in the old us of a and now we're gonna go in i guess we take a lift or like a funicular kind of thing inside the mountain and go up and then maybe walk back down um, but we'll be inside the rest of the time which is pretty cool
have to say when we first got off the lift and started walking up, it was it was beautiful. But I was kind of like, this isn't such a big deal. But then we actually did go inside the mountain and it was really cool and thunderous and beautiful and loud and dark and wet and cold for sure. So it turned out to be a really cool um, experience. And it just reminded me how much the Swiss love to dig into hills, into mountains. They tunnel through everything. They love that stuff.